veteran referee, Mr. Paul Crosley, about to get this one underway. Three five-minute really rounds if they need them in the Cage Blue. Warriors featherweight division. That's what. Marco Sarashavi in the black. Captain Jack Claffey in the red. And that's a pair of shorts, Retta, isn't it? <laughs> 10 out of 10, would wear. Sarashavi trying for the head kick early. Claffey coming in some way under the 146 pound limit yesterday, weighed 141.9. Easily a 135 or no? Yeah, I would think so. I'm curious, how did he get on in his um, bare knuckle boxing for you? Yeah, one by KO. Nice. I'd say he does class himself as a pugilist, so look for him to get those hands to work. Tries of right over the top there. Likes that front kick too. Yeah, on both legs too. Um, Sarasavi just cut the first one. Nice shot there from Sarasavi. Body lock to take the back. Claffy looking to break, a, uh, break the wrist. Uh, the grip here on the wrist. Oh, great job to roll through there from Claffy. If he can complete this. Yeah, it doesn't seem too phased when he got in a bad position there. Look at Claffy to take the back here. Doesn't quite get the sit around that we wanted with Sarazavi underneath. Sarazavi just had the underhook on the, on the far side. Claffy attacking the neck. And we're straight back to this position with Sarazavi on the back here. Yeah, nice shoulder lock to keep the position from Sarazavi. You see him reaching over. Just trapping the far shoulder. Look for him to go body lock from this position. He's in a good spot here. He looks like it's around the neck, but not under. And of course, Clappy now having to carry all the weight of Cyrus Javi on his back. Dips down a little. Cyrus Javi taking that leg to just recenter himself on the back here without falling off. But Claffy doing a good job of two on one on wrist control and going to the far side. To clear the hand from around his neck. We're still in a, a bad position here. Sergei looking for a squeeze here on the neck. I don't know if he has a quite underneath the chin or not. Looking to go short choke. Seems to have it. Seems to be squeezing. Seems to squeeze from Sergei here. Just adjusting that grip now. And this is a long time left in the round. Seems to be just across the jaw here for, of Claffy. Taffy peels that hand off. There's the body lock from Sarasavi. Doesn't seem too phased here at all, Claffy. But he's got to work at his shoulders to the mat. Look for Claffy to bridge up towards the cage now and take... Not take anything, sorry, sorry, I should say, uh, fall into the guard of Sarasavi. But Sarasavi coming here, or coming up here on top for Mount. Back to half guard here from Claffy. Gets the underhook on the far side, looking for a roll through sweep. You see his right hand just on the hook in the, the right leg of Sarasavi. Looks like someone's cut there. Can't exactly see who. Looks like it might be Cyrus Yarvey, but we'll have to wait and see. Nice elbow, though. Yeah, Claffy's got to be careful here. He doesn't tie up both hands using the underhook around the waist and the leg. And having nothing to defend himself with. There's good, consistent grappling here from Cyrus Yarvey. He's not giving Claffy an inch. And he's letting strikes off while, while doing it. Half a minute left to play within this first round. Claffy survived some tough positions. Still time for Sarah Sharvey to do some damage here from this back position. Good 
Final seconds of the round. And the first frame is in the books. But he just doesn't seem too stressed in these positions or there's no emphasis on getting out of position at all. Getting the hands moving early is Claffy. Yeah, looks to have uh, woken up this round already. Right, comes out with a double jab right hand down the pipe. And a little bit more urgency this round. Yeah, we have a question mark kick there from Sarah Shaby. Great job disguising that entry. Switches the to single thing. leg here. Claffy defending well. Yeah, look for Sarah Shaby just to step through for the takedown. Oh, beautiful job. Beautiful move. That's a back take. A big elbow. He's on the neck here. Nice knee as well on the way up. I thought he was going to go full blown. Dustin Poirier pulling guard with guillotines here, but not quite. 60% of the time they work every <laughs> time. <laughs> and you've got to think the confidence for Claffy is going to be sky high at this point. Yeah, I think Serge Aby did throw the best in the first round. Not quite getting the squeeze on the neck, but like I said, Claffy didn't look too bothered by any of it. Nice combination from the Finn there. But in saying that, you're down around from being out grappled on the first round. And uh, having a nice friendly chat mid cage. Again, Sarah Shelby trying to disguise that takedown. A slip there from Claffy. That could be costly. Yeah, nice defense there from Claffy. Great balance. And again, he's going to come out on top here, you would think. Yeah, so I think Sarah Shelby just held on to that leg a little bit longer than he should have when, when going from the trip. If you, if you go to the ground with that position, it does give your opponent that room to come up and take the back from it. Good knees here from Claffy. He's kicking the back of the calf there. Certainly unique offense from Claffy. Sarah Shavi, they're looking very calm, very patient. He yeah, does a nice job of just pushing down on the hands to open the wrist. Still gets the takedown from Claffy. Straight back to his heat, uh, feet here from Sarah Shavi. The elbow there. Sarah so Sharpie tries the head kick. I mean, you can clearly see Claffy giving up a, a fair amount of size here, but he's doing a great job of not being out muscled and, and outgunned in these exchanges. Dip it ahead before the head kick attempt there from Sarah Javi. I would like to see Claffy just mix it up, throw, throw your feints out a little bit more, put a little what bit of snap on your punches, head kick attempt. The referee asking for a little bit of action there and Claffy trying to put his man on the cage. Sarah Javi just looking with a double on the hooks here but Claffy has a uh, over on that with his body lock. Look for him to just throw the leg around the corner and throw all his way forward. And takes the back here. Clappy sticking to the back now, just over a minute left to play within this second round. Yeah, see, I don't like, from that position, I don't like when a step across um, the, the opponent like that because they do tend to lose the position while the opponent's back or the side, I should say, is on the cage. Happy tried the elbow again. He's teased that a couple of times, so I was saying for Sarah Javi to keep an eye on. Big deep breath there from Sarah Javi. Job from Sarah Shavy to hit the match straight away. He's on the neck here. <laughs> Last 15 seconds of this round, big, big shots here from Claffy. Back at the half guard. 
His last swing came by arm triangle and his MMA debut as an amateur back in 2015 was via a, a modified guillotine choke. Just 100% here for the last round. Just shown that elbow again. You know, unless we see some big impactful moments, you know, these rounds could be decided by the thinnest of margins, so it really does behoove both guys to put their foot to the floor in this third round. You would certainly give the first round to Sarah Yardi, second round very close. You might lean to Claffy there, so everything to play for in this third. I don't even think there's an um, intent behind that front kick that Claffy is throwing. Just seems to be throwing it out there for range. Catches Sarah Shavi with an overhand right there, though. Sarah Shavi firing back. They went right again. again. I would like to see uh, Sarah Shavi go back to doing what he did in the first round, a big double leg attempt. You can see him just changing levels here. Sarah Shavi letting the hands go. Big deep breath there from the Finnish fighter. Oh, and there's a solid left hand from the southpaw. That's given Claffy something to think about. Oh, and he flies back. Business picking up here in the third round. So there's hands up, just cutting a little bit low for me. Yeah, perhaps feeling the pace of this one a little bit now. You can see Sarah Shavey just looking at that front leg from uh, Claffy as if he's going to initiate a big double leg or single leg here. Right well, hand over the top there from Claffy. Yeah, good head movement as well to get out of the way of the counter. And there's that double leg attempt. Down. Paul, it's got to be frustrating at this stage of the fight when you're putting that energy into the takedown, so they're, they're just getting stuffed like that. Yeah, but he's not setting it up the way he did in the first round. Big right hand there from Sarah Javi. Tried to hide it behind the shot there, and again, though, can't be able to sprawl out. But he seems to be shooting and stopping, rather than shooting through his uh, opponent and going right to the fence and, and carrying it through with the takedown. Claffy just gaining a bit of momentum here in the second, or oh, the third round, I should say, sorry. Claffy's corner telling him that the, the takedown is there. Perhaps want to see their man dishing out some punishment on top. Nice yeah, shot to the body. I think the takedown is there too, but the way he's been shooting in, he's just, uh, like I said, he just seems to be shooting and stopping on the, on the spot. And once Claffy uh, gets the sprawl, he just gives up. Nice uppercuts and a dirty boxing there catches a knee. Bit of showmanship from Claffy here. Yeah, so if I'm Claffy and I have that much energy in the third, I would just go balls to the wall. Big take down here from Claffy. Claffy steps back and calls his man up. Seems to be having fun here with the hands in the third. Big body kick there from Sarah Javi. Tries the uppercut. Oh, nice combination there for Claffy. Sarah Shavi firing back though. Doesn't have as much sting on the shots in this third round. Smooth clash of heads there on the way in. Claffy just dip, dipping down for a double leg attempt here. I'd like to see him switch for, a, uh, for the single leg and run the pipe. Gets the double leg. Straight to the body lock, letting some shots off here. Nice work from Sarah Shavey to get back to his feet. Big take down there from Sarah Shavey. And I think that's called an Awu to Gary on the outside. Completes it. And again, Clappy able to 
Scrambles to a good position, jumps the guillotine. There you go, looks tight, looks tight. Has he got his hands clasped? Seems to only have one hand on it. And Dustin Poirier will be spinning and walking around his house for joy. That Claffy just jumped in with that guillotine. Well, ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of mixed martial arts action, we go to our judges' school cards. Our judges' school is contest. 29-28, Claffy. 29-28, Sarah Yarby. And 29-28 for your winner, by way of split decision. In the red corner, Claffy. Jack Claffy. Half-foot decision win for Captain Jack Claffy. A split decision. One judge seeing it to Sarah Sharvey, and you can certainly see how that will be for some close rounds.